CBS 6 News starts now. Significant snowstorm through last night and this morning. I'll talk about how much more is on the way and how much longer the snow will fall. The White House is opening up some specific presidential pardon applications. We'll show you who stands to benefit and exactly who qualifies. Plus a dose of reality report, the zombie drug. It's an ominous name for a substance that's made its way to the capital region. We explore the dangers. And good morning, everybody. If you're just joining us, we are under a weather authority alert. So we're going to send it right on over to meteorologist Sam Coplin for a check on your Saturday forecast. Sam. Yeah, we are still seeing the snow falling right now. Here's a look at Saratoga Springs. Seems road crews have gotten an opportunity to get on top of the snow. Perhaps intensity's pulling back a little bit right now as the sun starts to rise. As we look at our snowfall so far, this is updated as of 7.20 a.m., but I keep having to update these numbers as the snow, again, is still falling. Corinth checking in at 11 inches. Queensbury, 10, down in Albany. We're at 7.1. Niska Una, 7 inches. Still in progress, though. A lot of areas could overperform with this storm. But see how it's starting to clear out a little bit to the west? Well, the intensity is going to start pulling back as the storm pushes off to the east, but until that point, it's still coming down across the capital region uh, over the the North Country and parts of eastern or say western New England right now. Here is our system again pulling off to the north and east on the southeast side. You could be mixing with a little bit of sleet and rain. We have seen some rain reports in a place like Poughkeepsie further off to the south. But again, the snow, rain, any type of precipitation is going to be winding down by the late morning. Wind also pulling back. We've had gusts as high as 50 miles per hour over parts of Vermont. They will pull back later on in the morning and then this afternoon you'll really start to notice a difference out there so snow and sleet's going to be winding down we're talking a broad five to ten inches some spots surpassing that could be seeing over a foot maybe 13 14 inches but then we do look to get a break for a little bit we do have a couple of systems on deck that i'll talk about in your full forecast